actually, I've seen is Haskell Cody. And I wanted to talk a little bit about that because as we were talking before this started, I was watching Tim Sweeney's interview at, at um, Lex Friedman and I was, I was very surprised by how much a CEO of such a big company, such a hacker, such a, such a nerd, right? He is a total and, programming language nerd. And let's, let's, let's talk about, about that a little bit because I, I really see, like after watching that, that, that interview, I see a lot of, 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 of power in making functional programming very mainstream with verse because you know like it's supposed it's going to be the next generation of um gaming software is going to be written in functional programming with that right with unreal 6 i believe so tell us a story how you got there how things are going how how is developing things there working with these people uh, so he wrote an implementation or early implementation of verse in haskell for instance so he's not it's not like he doesn't know Haskell. Oh, actually, I've seen his Haskell code. He doesn't know Haskell. <laughs> <laughs> Did he also cut that out of the podcast? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> I shouldn't say he doesn't know Haskell. He doesn't know the Haskell libraries. I think he knows the language well enough. So, so Verse is not a pure functional language. Uh, it, it's a functional logic language. What does that mean? Well, so it's like some of these other uh, functional logic languages like curry. So you, you have uh, these existential variables. So variables that are, you sort of solve for what their values are rather than computing it. Mm. So it, it's like prologue that, that you can, uh, if you're lucky, you can run your functions backwards mm -hmm. you can give it the output and they will produce the input uh, so he wants to be able to do that if you want to but he also wants to have all the functional uh, stuff available mm -hmm. never seen both of those together mm, yeah and so um i when i'd seen them i've always dismissed it as being this, you shouldn't mix these sort of yeah. pure logic languages they're beautiful they're sort of logic you do it that way or pure functions yeah. that's beautiful you combine them you get something weird and i still think it's a bit weird but okay. but, but i'm uh, versus a very nice design